All right, all right. Good morning, Facebook. Good morning, BFIT Nation. Welcome to another round of Motivation Mondays. Uh, myself, your BFIT ambassador, Roy Montez, and I am coming with you. A com who's joining me is my partner, Senior Master Sergeant Barry. How are we doing today, C Sergeant Barry? Good morning, Roy. I'm doing well. We might have an additional workout partner. So all right, yeah, the more straight. the merrier. I love it, I love it. I see that your partner is excited to work out with us as well. Um, <laughs> once again, uh, thank you to everyone who's joining us today. I hope you are ready to uh, put in some sweat uh, to, to pay it forward for yourself because today's workout is a tough one. I'll, I'll start off uh, right, right from the bat here. Uh, it, it's a fun one. It's a fun one, but it'll definitely challenge us for the better here. So once again, be fit live. And um, if you're new to this Monday's workout, we do a, um, a 40 second on 20 second off strength interval training uh, that will test your total body here. So we're hitting shoulders, we're hitting biceps, we're hitting our, our quads, our glutes, our calves and our core for stability here. So we accomplish our total body here in just under 30 minutes. So now's the time to grab your water, grab your towels, let's get ready. Um, I'll go through the, the workout, I'll demo and uh, mock up some workouts here. And then we'll go through some uh, dynamic stretching to get our bodies and our minds right uh, and ready to work. And then we will go into our uh, workout for today. Uh, so, uh, <clears throat> what we're going to be tackling today is we're going to start off with uh, exercise one and two are going to be a dumbbell clean and press. So, dumbbell uh, exercise one will be with our left hand, uh, exercise two will be with our right. Uh, exercise three, we are going to tackle a dumbbell squat and press. Now, I say dumbbell, but if you have any sort of resistance that you would like to add, whether it's a water bottle, uh, whether it's a, a weighted plate, or if you have um, you know, smaller water bottles, for example, to add a little bit of resistance to your comfort level, please uh, feel free and grab anything that you're, uh, that's around your house uh, to do so. And exercise four will be a plank, uh, which we will come off of our elbows here and alternating leg lifts. So you'll see our back legs alternating up and down as we hold that solid plank, okay? <clears throat> and again, these workouts are they're programmed and, and geared for uh, uh, those of us who have very minimal space, very minimal equipment, but we are able to accomplish them at our homes or outside or, or uh, with, with very minimal equipment here. So again, we are working four rounds, 40 seconds of work, 20 seconds of rest, and one minute of rest in between each of those four rounds. All right, all right, How we're, sound good, sound good? Sounds awesome. <laughs> okay. Let me go ahead and grab a little bit of water here. And we are gonna start out with some, some dynamic stretching here. So the idea behind some dynamic stretches is we're just trying to stretch out, warm up our bodies and, and stretch multiple muscle groups at a time to get our bodies prepared for the work that we're about to do here. So let's start off with the dynamic quad stretch here. I'm gonna reach back with my left hand and my left quad. I'm gonna reach back and my right arm is gonna go all the way up above my head here, trying to stabilize, trying to balance here. Right leg goes back, left arm goes all the way up above my head <laughs> while we work around obstacles. <laughs> 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 Good work, Sergeant Barry. Oh, you're fine. <laughs> All right, we're going to do this for about 30 seconds here to your pace. Arms all the way up, extending a little bit further than the last time. And push those hips forward to really accentuate and stretch out those hip flexors. Nice, nice, nice. A few more in here. There we go. Last one here. All right, good work. We're gonna go to the top of the mat here for some reverse lunge reaches. My right leg is gonna extend all the way back here. I'm lunging, my hands are clasping up above my head and stretching out to my left side, okay? 
back to the top and we'll repeat left leg goes all the way back. I'm extending up and reaching over to my right. Holding that position for just a two count or so. Up, over. Nice, nice. Let's go to your speed here. Dial into your body preference and try and get our body nice and warm here. This is a great time to take advantage of warming up that body, seeing where you're at mentally and seeing where your body is at. Scan that body and see if there's any points that are sore or tight. And let's try and work those out here. Good, good. Let's go to some fixed feet lateral lunges here. Feet are really wide apart here, really wide. Let's go over to our right and we are just lunging over. Lateral lunges here, nothing too strenuous, nothing too deep here. I'm gonna support my hands on my quads just to get a nice good stretch in that inner thigh while warming up our glutes, our hamstrings. We have a lot of lower body work today. So trying to get this dialed in, trying to get our bodies and our minds dialed in here. All right, coming up on that 30 second mark. Good, good, good. All right, let's move into walkouts here. We're gonna step back to the back of our mats here. My feet are gonna be shoulder width apart. I'm stretching down nice and slow, reaching for those toes, slowly walking out here into a high plank. There we go. Retracting back, nice and slow, touching those toes and then repeating back out to that high plank position, okay? Again, with that high plank, your hand should fall directly underneath your shoulders. Nice and easy here. Really stretching out our hamstrings with this lower stretch, reaching out. We're gonna do some plank work here, so this is gonna be nice. Warming up those shoulders. And one more at your pace and we'll come back up top. All right, good work, good work. Let's move into some YTWs here. Let's move these shoulders around. So we are gonna come together with our hands. We're gonna make a big Y back to center. Let's go ahead and make that T center and then that YW here. All right, our shoulder blades should be contracting back back up to that Y, should feel some muscle, some muscle, some blood flow into that, into those shoulders, stretching out a little bit wider than last time. And that W showing off those arms. Nice. One more set here. Big Y, big Y, stretch it out here. Nice. Let's go into that T and W. Good work, all right. Let's move into our hinge reaches as our last dynamic stretch here. Our hands are gonna be extended over our heads, soft bend at the knees. We are hinging at the hips, lowering to about 45 degrees and raising all the way back up to the starting position, okay? Hands are right above the head, hinging at the hips here, nice and slow. Again, we're warming up those hamstrings. Our, glute, our glutes should be activated. They should be firing. Our core is nice and tight, nice and engaged, hinging at the hips. Squeeze those glutes at the top. Keep those arms nice and straight. Good work. Three more here. All right, good work, good work. Now, while y'all towel off and grab some water, let me go into a uh, demonstration of these four exercises here. So our dumbbell clean and press, we're actually gonna clean here. Today we'll clean, not from the floor, but we'll start from the knee here, okay? We're gonna do single arms. So we'll start off with our left, our left hand. We are going to clean up. So we are gonna 
We're working on power and explosiveness here, okay? We're working on power through those heels, extending up through those glutes, through those hips, raising that weight as if you were a, um, a hammer curl, okay? That's racked up to the top. And then we will extend all the way up here, okay? And then slowly lower to that starting position. Again, one and two. Nice, there we go. All right, that's a nice, nice compound movement. We are gonna get a lot of bang for our buck here with, with this clean to dumbbell press here. All right, that's one and two. Dumbbell squat press. We've done this before, guys. We're gonna rack our weights here. Our feet are gonna be shoulder width apart. We are gonna squat down to our comfort level, extending all the way up and pressing above our heads here. Returning back with that rack weight, squatting down to our comfort level, making sure our knees are tracking over our toes and we are seated back in that imaginary chair to our comfort level once again and extending up above our head. That's exercise three and we will move into a plank with alternating leg lifts here. So we are coming off of our elbows into a plank position for 40 seconds of work we are just going to alternate that leg lift, keeping that leg nice and straight, keeping that form nice and straight. Your back, your back should be nice and long and flat here. Head is in a neutral position. And we're just going to slowly raise those legs, activating those glutes for exercise number four. Again, 40 seconds of work, 20 seconds of rest, four rounds with one minute rest <clears throat> in between each round. I'm going to grab some water, towel off, set my timer and we will get started. Mm. <clears throat> All right, let's make sure and stay hydrated through this workout because it will test us. It's gonna test us today, BFit Nation. If you are just joining us today, let us know where you're watching from let us know which exercise that you like the most. I'm always interested in hearing what movements you like the most because it allows us to have a lot of fun with those types of movements as well. And we will continue to incorporate them. Mm. <clears throat> All right, here we go. <laughs> All right, everybody's ready, BFET Nation. Dumbbell clean and press. <clears throat> Left arm, we are starting in 10. All right, let me grab my dumbbell. My workstation is good to go. <clears throat> dumbbell clean and press with our left hand in three, two, one, let's go. Our weight is driving up. Nice power movement here through those heels and extending over our heads here, nice and slow. Let's go ahead and load up that arm, load up those legs and power through. Good, 17 more seconds of work here. Let's go ahead and pick a weight beat fit nation that's most challenging to you or what you have available. Five more seconds of work here. Three, two, one, getting that last rep and time. 20 seconds of rest here and we'll move over to our right hand. Okay, this is a, a really good compound movement here. We're, we're working a lot of muscle groups with this one. In five, four, three, two. All right, dumbbell clean and press here. Nice, good work. Let's focus up, let's focus on driving through those hips driving through that glute and extending up over your head here. Nice and controlled. Name of the game here, form and quality overall here. 10 more seconds of work here. There we go, good work. Five more seconds, four, three, and rest. One more for me, 14 seconds of 
rest here and we will move into the dumbbell squat and press. Again, if you don't have any dumbbells, feel free and grab anything that you may have access to. All right, two, one, we're working here. Dumbbell squat and press here. Good work, good work. All right, let's make sure to squat down, hinging at the hips here, lowering that, lowering that butt in that imaginary chair here. And again, our legs are gonna feel this, our shoulders are gonna feel this. Keeping that core nice and activated, nice and tight. Be mindful of that extension through your arms, two, one, and time. 20 seconds of rest here. First round is cruising on by here. In 10, we have alternating plank lifts. So we're down on the ground in five, on the elbows, and let's work here. So our elbows are gonna be directly under our shoulders for that stability and support here. Keeping our core nice and tight. Nice and engaged, bringing that navel back to the spine, contracting those glutes, raising those legs about a foot, a foot and a half off the floor, alternating to your speed here. All right, seven more seconds of work here. Five, keep those hips square. Three, two, one. All right, good work. Good work, good finish, good finish. Way to finish up the first round. Grab some water, towel off. Now's a great time to catch your breath. I know we have very limited amount of rest in between each exercise, each set. So that's forcing us to keep our heart rate elevated to burn some additional calories, working on that cardiovascular system and really testing us here. Catch your breath here for 20 more seconds. Grab some water. Mm. Ten more seconds here. Round two, first round we learned it. Second round, let's own it here in five. Left hand, clean and press in two, one. Here we go, soft bend at the knees, hinge at the hips, power through and extend all the way up to the top here. There we go. Nice, nice. Good work, good work. Left arm should be loaded here. We should be feeling our glutes. A little bit of our back here from that starting position of the clean. There we go, keep that arm, that right hand nice and wide for counterbalance two, one, and time. I'm gonna keep my dumbbell in hand, work on some grip strength here for 10 seconds here. We'll go and start with our right arm here, right hand. Dumbbell clean and press for me in two, one, right arms loaded. Here we go. Nice. There we go. Make sure and bend those knees a little bit. Extend up through that back, through the shoulders. There should be one fluid movement here. 18 more seconds of work. Again, a lot of bang for our buck here. A lot of posterior action going on with our glutes, our hamstrings, our calves, if we can come up to the top, out of the hole here. Two, one, and time. All right, all right, dumbbells are down. Only for a minute though. We have dumbbell presses coming up. Dumbbell squat and press. <laughs> All right, I'm loaded. Loaded up here, have my weights. I'm racking up top and let's work here. 40 seconds of work after 20 seconds of rest. This is our second round going 
third exercise in. If you are just joining us, we are working for 40 seconds, resting for 20, with one minute rest in between each round to maximize our time while trying to tackle multiple muscle groups during this workout here. 10 more seconds, flying by here. Five, four. All right, and time. Last rep in. Good work. 20 seconds of rest here. Make sure and stay hydrated. Grab that water. Plank alternating leg lifts. Coming up next in five, four, three, two. All right, let's work here again. My shoulders are gonna be directly under my, <laughs> over my elbows, rather. My hands are gonna be nice and spread out. My view is actually right at my fingertips here. Keeping that head nice and neutral. My spine is nice and long. Back is relatively flat here. Engaging that core. 10 more seconds here, let's go. Alternating leg lifts. Really forcing you to stabilize. Three, two, one, and time. Good work. <laughs> All right, those aren't easy. I know those aren't easy. Good job, good job, good work. How are we doing, BFit Nation? <clears throat> Let me know if you have any questions. Leave them in the comments below. Let me know if you're working out with us. 30 seconds of rest here, catch your breath, towel off. Stay hydrated, drink that water. <laughs> I think our other workout partner decided it was too hard, so she, she deserted us. <laughs> Did she? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> We're gonna. <laughs> She's smart. Gonna to... She's smart. <laughs> I like it, I like it. Five more seconds of rest here, and we are gonna start left hand, weighted in hand. All right, let's work here. Dumbbell clean to press here. <laughs> Next time we'll, we'll tell her it won't be so easy. <laughs> All right, 20 seconds in, halfway there. Left arm is working. Lower body glutes are working. Let's work on that power through the hips and exploding up to the top, overhead. Eight more seconds here. Five, four, three, two. Get that last rep in and time. Good work. All right, I'm hanging on that dumbbell. Right arm is coming up next for 40 seconds of work here in five. Four, two, all right, and we're working here. Again, hinging at the hips with a soft bend at the knees here. Working on that explosion up with power through the top of the movement and overhead pressing here. Nice and controlled, back down. There we go, 18 more seconds of work here. Good job, good job, good work. Let's keep going, 10 more seconds. Five, four, three, two, one last rep and time. Good work, good work. Squat to press her up next. Three out of our four rounds, halfway through here. Halfway through our third round, we are flying by. 20 seconds are up and we're working here. All right. Again, you may ask yourself why we work so much lower body. It's the biggest muscle group that you have in your lower body, obviously. So it is just twice as much taxing for you to put effort in to making this work here. So 
we are working overtime here. Five more seconds of work. Let's finish that song. Three, two, one, and time. Good work. Awesome work. Awesome job. Awesome job. Plank to alternating leg lifts in 10. Grab that water if you need. Stay hydrated. Stay on the deck here. In five, four, three. All right, let's work. Elbows down. Hands are extended up. My legs are lifting one at a time here. Good job. Again, my gaze, my gaze is just at my fingertips. That's where I'm looking, keeping that core tight. With those alternating leg lifts, you can really feel your posterior chin, your glute activating. 12 more seconds of work here. Keep those legs nice and straight. Keeping that core engaged for three, two, one, and time. Awesome work. Great round, great round. <laughs> three rounds down, one more round to go. A grin. This is a, a great example that it doesn't take a lot of time to build up your strength, to work on your cardiovascular system, to work on your endurance and stability here. <laughs> and just under, ah, just under 35 minutes, I would say. Complete workout, top to bottom here. I hope you set yourself up for the best possible workout by staying hydrated before the workout, getting in those carbs, getting in those proteins to sustain you throughout this workout here. 10 more seconds of rest here. Then we're going into our left arm dumbbell clean. Clean your breath here into one, loaded up here, left arm, extending up through the hips, down to the bottom of the squat and powering up overhead here. There we go. Nice, nice, nice. Focus on power, focus on control and that extension all the way up through the top of the movement here, load it up and extend all the way out. Seven more seconds here. Three, two, one, and time. Good work. Keep that weight in hand here. We're gonna shift it over to our right side. 10 more seconds. All right, in five. Good work, good work. Here we go. 20 seconds of rest completed. 40 seconds of work on the clock. Nice. Last round. Let's make it our best round. You can pick up the pace. Let's go ahead and do so. We can scale up. You have the option to. Let's scale up with a little bit heavier weight. 13 more seconds here. 10. There we go. Good work. Finish it out strong. Three, two, one. Last rep and time. There we go. Sergeant Barry getting that extra credit in. I see it. <laughs> <laughs> All Remember right. that for the next workout, Roy. <laughs> <laughs> Good work. All right. 20 seconds is done in three, two, one. Load it up and let's work here. 40 seconds here. Dumbbell. Squat and press. Our second to last exercise. Coming up on the fourth round here. Let's finish out strong. Again, we're doing a squat to overhead press. Our knees should be tracking over our toes here. Sitting back and down to our comfort level. Driving up through those heels, through those quads for seven more seconds and extending up over our head for three, two, one, and time. <laughs> Good work. Dumbbells can be put down. All right, let me adjust you here. 
alternating plank leg lifts. In five, four, three, we're down. And we're moving here, 40 seconds of work here. Again, let's alternate those leg lifts to your pace, to your comfort. However, if you wanna scale up, let's go a little faster. <laughs> and if you really wanna scale up, let's go ahead and lift that leg and lift an arm at the same time. <laughs> 10 more seconds of work here. Six, let's finish it out. Last set, best set. In three, two, one, and time. <laughs> Good work. Good work, Sergeant Bay. Thank Good you. Good work, Pit Nation. Absolutely, absolutely. I will say, if you really load yourself up and focus on that clean and press, again, that's a really, really good movement. Again, you're getting a lot of bang for your buck with that clean and press here. So workout number, exercise number one and two, a lot of bang for your buck. <laughs> Let me catch my breath here. Towel off, grab that water. How are we doing, B-Fit Nation? That Stay plank exercise, it. man, you could fill it in your, your abdomen, your back, your glutes, your shoulders. Right. It's really good. Uh, absolutely. And that's what's so great, uh, progressing through our, our planks and our core work as we've gone on and as we've come to this point is, is, is what's really great is we're allowing ourselves to pivot off of one foot for stability and it forces the rest of your body to pick up the slack so to speak, and work on that, that stability, that control, that balance, <laughs> really forcing you to engage the core, the glutes, your hamstrings, and your shoulders all at once. <laughs> Again, if you caught this workout today, Motivation Mondays, we're here every Monday for your Be Fit Live. 40 seconds of work, 20 seconds of rest, four rounds, and one a minute rest in between each round. And just at... 30 minutes or just under, we've completed a full workout for our full total body. <sighs> and I just uh, a quick shout out here. I'm <laughs> wearing pink here. October kicks off Breast Cancer Awareness Month. So I am, uh, I'm, I am be fit for all of the women who have uh, currently had or uh, have breast cancer. So I, I think uh, October is a great way to bring awareness to our health and wellness. Uh, make sure and get your health assessments in, make sure and get your wellness checks in um, and, uh, <laughs> and let's continue to be fit and stay strong. Sergeant Barry, any last words uh, before we uh, click off? All right, as always, thanks again for keeping me accountable. Mm -hmm. um, always a good, great workout, always challenging uh, and but fun. So thank you. Absolutely. Thank you so much. And thank you to everyone who, uh, who's, who watched. Thank you for your comments. Uh, make sure and let us know where you're watching from, which exercise was your favorite, which exercise was the most challenging and the most fun for you. Um, I enjoy uh, reading your comments as the weeks progressed and I can read and see um, a lot of uh, uh, reoccurring individuals who come back and, and they really enjoy it. So I thank you. I thank you for joining us. I thank you for uh, living, be fit and uh, stay strong, stay healthy, stay safe, um, stay ready and stay resilient. And we will see you next Monday. <laughs>